So we've got a diagram showing us a quadratic equation, but we're just told it's y equals f of x. We're told that the only vertex of the graph is at 1, 2, that's where it turns, 1, 2. And we're asked to give the coordinates of the vertex if the function has been moved up by 3. So if we move this graph up by 3, then what was at 1, 2 will now be at 1, 5. So our vertex is moved to 1, 5. If we do f of x minus 2, and this pushes it 2 to the right, 2 to the right. So moving across 2 to the right then, the point 1, 2 will move to the point 3, 2. So our vertex moves to 3. Pen 3, 2. Now finally we're asked to tell, uh, describe the transformation when y of f of x is transformed to give the curve y equals minus f of x, y equals minus f of x. And this always gives you a reflection in the x-axis. This is because um, basically you are changing the y-coordinate, the f of x value, it changes its sign, so if it was positive it becomes negative, if it's negative it becomes positive, and you end up getting a reflection in the x-axis.